Nogle here. Welcome back to Jenny LeClue, Detective Who. So when we last left off, we were able to find a machine that would accept the Dean's ring, and it printed out a card key for us. We also ran another experiment from one of the Zazer spheres, and it seemed to send out huge shock waves that we think probably caused the cave-in of the mine and killed all those miners, so did the Glatzes know about this? It's hard to say. I'm not sure. But when that was over, a single page dropped down from very high up in the Zazosphere. And this is the page. Let's see what it says. Uh, welcome, serial number. With this book, you can now ink, uh, encode and decode messages. Okay, unless specified by a high-level director, all secret communications require the use of this book. Please note, this system includes an extra layer of obfuscation. Okay, so that's what we were missing. As long as the key page is destroyed, the true message will remain hidden, even if authorized decoding occurs. So that's we were missing the salt. General rules. Commit the key page to memory. To immediately remove and incinerate the key page. If not possible, then it must be destroyed in some other effective way or by submerging in deep water. Enjoy years of secret ciphers. Well, thankfully for us, they did not do that. Very, very good. Radio communication. Okay. Radio is the primary motor of transmission. Messages to only be sent with secure frequencies. With band modulation and spectral, spectral nesting. I don't know what that means. Written communication. Written communication could only be used in case of emergency. For eyes only high level instructions, messages should exclusively be sent through secure tube, tube network. Upon a tube network, <laughs> SDN. Upon receipt and decoding, all documents should be destroyed by incineration. Flip. <gasps> Oh. Okay. Oh. Snap. Do I have to do this crap? Oh boy. So, the home rabbit used the first letter. The hawk and the weasel used the first two letters. I hope they help with this because I'm never going to remember this. Goose used the last letter. Wolf and sheep used the last two letters. And. Uh, Shamu used the last three letters. Seems convoluted. It does seem convoluted. Okay. Um, wow. Preparing messages. The message should be as brief as possible, but also be clear and unmistakable to the receiver. Before encoding, always check for possible misinterpretations of the message. Where possible, choose keywords that form coherent sentences. This is a crucial part of secondary obfuscation and drastically increases the security of the mess secret message. This is the missing page from the code book. Yeah. The text gave instructions and rules for communicating using a special code. Indeed. That's why the radio broadcast didn't make sense. It was designed to look like a sinister message, but the real message is hidden inside. Oh. To aid brevity, standard abbreviations must be used. Some syllables and single letters can be admitted without cost eligibility. Punctuation, including periods, can also be admitted unless the omission ruins legibility. However, avoid uniformly abbreviated words. These repetitions increase the likelihood of unauthorized decoding. A varying treatment of abbreviation renders unauthorized decoding basically more difficult. Okay. So. Blam. I was right. Okay. So what the real message. Indeed. Only certain letters from each word are used in the underline. Oh dear. I hope they're gonna help me with this, because I am not so gonna Jenny began by finding them. Oh. Let's, let's just go through. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh. 
All right, I see. This one, this is first two letters, so. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Hmm. All righty here. We'll go through here. Let's see. A little confusing, but whatever. We'll figure it out. Uh, message three. Let's see. This is the... Hmm. Not sure. We'll see. I'm still a little confused by this because it does seem very... Uh... Okay. Okay, now let's do th this one. Did I, I miss one? I must have. Okay. Did I? Hmm. Oh, G General. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Hmm. All right. Well. Hmm. Okay. This is weird, but okay. I, mean, I don't feel like I'm really doing much, but thankfully, Jenny's doing all the hard lifting here. Okay. Jenny's doing all the hard work here. Okay. So change animal to use the last letter. All right. So nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. There. Okay. Wow. This would be so difficult to make a message like this. Okay. Use the first two letters. i use the last two letters. <laughs> okay. Huh. Okay. All right. Change Use the last... Okay, here we go. Okay, so every single word then should have either be completely crossed out, or no, it should be partially crossed out with partial words in it. Okay. Now all that's left to do is assemble the pieces. Oh, God. Okay, um, I guess just in order? Okay, oh, they, oh, they click in. Okay, thank goodness. Oh, I see. Oh, just in order. I just, okay. Whew. I, I think... Here's, you know what I think about this? I think the developers made this and the users were supposed to do this themselves instead of it just clicking in. Because I'm, I'm just putting it in there and it just clicks in. And I think it was way too hard and obtuse. Yeah. I think that's, I think that's exactly what happened. And so they sort of made it easy. They dumped it down. But, you know, I, I appreciate that. It is interesting. Find... Okay, it says Caesar, but I'm sure he means Caesar. So who's HLC? Wait! Is that Dad? Still alive. Trapped on other side. Find Caesar. H. L. C. H L C. Is that is that our to dad? Most people, these letters would be meaningless, but to Jenny, they were as familiar as her own birthday. Dad? Oh my gosh, is he still alive? This message is from you. A fantasy. How could Henry Leclou have sent this message? Henry Leclou was still alive. The mere possibility caused Jenny's heart to pound in her chest. They never found his body. We buried an empty coffin. That was true. But what connection did her father have to the Zazer Spheres? Yeah, Indeed. Strasbury, and the Dean was involved in all of this. Zazer sounds just like Zazer. It does. And if Dad had the codebook, then he knew about the Council of Three. She read the message once more. Trapped on other side. Jenny pulled the freshly printed access card from her pocket. I mean, I guess it Just could be... Hasty conclusion. Yeah, I mean, it could be trapped in the side of that, but it could be something else, too, with the weird stuff they're doing. What if he didn't die? What if they just wanted him out of the picture? What if he's a prisoner, trapped on the other side of the giant metal door? Maybe. 
It was a plausible hypothesis. Indeed. But incredibly far-fetched. Yeah, I agree with that. And my mom knew all this. Yeah. That's why they sent the man in black to silence her. Her hands were shaking. Maybe. Her eyes filled with tears. I I am I'm not sure that what's going on with Jenny's mom is what is really going is what Jenny thinks going on is what's really going on. Was our great detective letting emotion overpower logic? No. H L C. It can't mean anything else. It's true. The message is from my dad. I have to get to mom before the man in black does. Okay. We'll go to the underground room together. Okay. We'll rescue my dad. Maybe. And everything can go back to the way it was. Could be. This was her hope, her longing. Indeed. But nothing would ever be the same again. Oh. That's pretty ominous. Let's see. Missing piece to the kid's book, of course. The secret message uses two steps of encryption. Clever. Still alive, trapped on the other side. Find Zazer. HLC. He actually said Zazer, not Zazer. S A Z E R. Dad, he's still alive, she thinks. I've, I've, th I've thought that for a while, too. It's a little curious when you find no parts of the body and they just assume he's dead. I have to get to mom and tell her everything before we can go back to the underground office and rescue dad. Indeed. Here we go. Okay, so where are we going now? Let's see. We need to go... We need to go find Zazer. Well, first we need to find mom. Break her out of prison. And... See if we can open that ominous metal door. That's going to be next time. Thanks for watching my playthrough of Jenny LeClue Detective Oot. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks again.